the hottest temperatures of the year upon us, at least so far the hottest temperatures of the year. But today was the hottest day this year officially with a high of 112. We did also tie a record here in Phoenix, a record that had been sitting in the books since back in 1910, officially topping out at 112 this afternoon. Still very hot, a little bit breezy in downtown Phoenix right now. We have a few thunderstorms across the high country providing for some of these breezes around the valley. Here's a look at our temps around the state and we're still sitting at 110 in Phoenix as well as Gila Bend. We've now dropped below the century mark in Kingman, a comfortable 80 degrees in Flagstaff, 87 out toward Winslow. Here's some of those gusty winds and we're seeing some higher gusts in the vicinity of a few of those thunderstorms closer to Sholo and Winslow as well as Greer. These storms will not be impacting the metro area tonight, but we could see a few gusty winds with some outflows from those storms coming in uh, from the west or from the east, I should say. And I uh, see a little bit of lightning, but no severe weather is anticipated and those thunderstorms will die down after sunset. Tomorrow afternoon, we'll see a very similar picture with a few thunderstorms firing up for the high country during the heat of the day. Those will die down around sunset and the exact same scenario plays out again on Sunday afternoon. This is not going to be a widespread rain event, really no severe weather is anticipated, but a few storms will be possible up in the mountains mountains this weekend. In the valley, it's going to be a dry weekend, sizzling as well. Saturday, a high of 108. Sunday, we tie the record of 109 degrees. That record's been in the books since 2012. And then on Monday, we'll break that excessive heat and drop down to about 106. A great place to go this weekend to beat the heat is the Salt River. Temps will be in the triple digits there. Dry conditions expected there as well on Saturday. We also have a ozone pollution advisory for the day on Saturday as well. Here's our seven day outlook with those excessive heat warnings through 8 p.m. Sunday. Monday, we're back down to 106 and the low 100s return by late next week.